Thank God for a great day that he's made for us to come together to celebrate. Today's program is all about praise and thanksgiving we want to give to God in all that we have been through. Psalm 34, 3 says that, O oh, come, magnify the Lord with me, and let us exalt his name forever. So please, journey with me as we go into the house of God to join the choir in singing praise and thanksgiving to God. Thank you for joining. Let us go together. times like that of the COVID-19 pandemic which we all have endured defy the natural ability to appreciate. It is easy to see all the negative and troubling impact of COVID-19 with the rampaging of death, illness, loss of lives and loss of livelihood, loss of community and family bond and all that we all have been burdened with since the advent of COVID-19. Yet, in all these, the thankful hearts can look around and see God, His mercies and His faithfulness at work in us.
continue to worship the Lord in the beauty of his holiness. Because in him, we move and have our being. Father of everlasting grace, a very great and powerful hymn. So we come to praise God, our Father, who through his everlasting grace and his goodness and truth has preserved us till this time.
the midst of all the mistakes, tragic errors that have been made during the pandemic, we dare to reflect upon the assurance of God's pardon and its effects on our lives going forward. Who is a pardoning God like thee? May God's matchless grace and miracles of love fill the earth with grateful praise as it fills the choirs above. We are alive not because we are better than others, but because of God's own sovereign grace which has reached us and all humanity. May the God who has been merciful to us continue to bear us up in his love and see us through to the end of this pandemic. And may our grateful hearts cherish his provision and our tongues sing his praise for his bountiful care. It is my prayer that irrespective of the difficulty and the struggle that we are going through, the praises of our God and King shall continue to fill our hearts. Praises come from a grateful heart and singing with joy and laughter comes because we know that the God that we serve is a faithful God. I don't know what you have gone through during this pandemic. I don't know the difficulties that have gone on in your family, the isolation and the struggles. But we know of a God who invites us to journey with him even in our most difficult times and who holds our hands, who protects us, who preserves us and whose hands become a covering over us. There is no God than our God, the Heavenly Father, the Elohim, who has been with us in these times. And it is my prayer that his hand will continue to be a protective cover over you and your family and your loved ones. And in every step that you take, as we all get gradually out of this COVID-19 pandemic, may the praises of God continue to fill your heart and your mouth and may his blessings abound for us all. Amen.